Richard, are you? How are you? Um, welcome back. Uh, it's been a while since we've last seen you. A couple of scrap bouts. One of them you had to withdraw due to injury. Just talk to me about the time off and uh, like how frustrating was it because you were building some nice momentum coming off of back-to-back -back wins. Yeah, I was, I was involved in a car accident as well, and we believe that the impact led to hearing my voice there. But uh, yeah, it is what it is. I'm, I'm back. I'm, I'm you're never because it can get taken away from you very quickly. But uh, yeah, I'm back and you're never and I'm ready to go. Uh, mentally, how hard, I'm sure physically the process was hard, but mentally, how hard was that to come back from something again? Not too much for me. I'm, 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 I'm mentally strong, you know. And yeah, but I mean, obviously it was, it was, it was hard, but uh, I'm, I'm used to having it hard. I like it hard, so. And uh, during your absence, you've been called out by a couple of guys like Johnny Evelyn. How does it feel to have a target on your back, so to speak, and just have people constantly calling your name? Yeah, me and Johnny had a little bit of back and forth, but yeah, it's all good. Look, I mean, the one thing about me, I, I don't go into that side of it. I'm, I'm willing to fight anybody, so I'm here. So that's why I'm here. Your opponent, Alan Carlos, is coming off a much longer layoff, of course, than you. I mean, he's only fought a couple of times in the past you know, six years or so. Are you expecting uh, some ring rust from him? Like, what? Uh, and how much do you know about him? I know nothing at all other than his name is Alan. Uh, I mean, he's a jiu-jitsu right boy. Uh, I, I, I can handle jiu-jitsu right, so... Yeah, I don't know much about him. I didn't know him. Well, it's not just him. I never do. As I say, I deal with what's in front of me when it's in front of me. So I usually do all right. Thank you. Uh, John. Uh, first of all, good to see you back. Um, you. Obviously, a bit of a layoff for you. You know, as you say, you had the injury beforehand. Coming back, and obviously, you know, not quite a home crowd, but fairly close to home being in London, obviously. Are you going to be looking to make a massive statement coming back to a big London crowd? Yeah, of course. I mean, it's like my second home. I lived here for, for on and off over over 10 years plus. So, like, I mean, uh, yeah, uh, I mean, after the layoff, as I said, you know, you just you, you respect what's taken away from you. So, but not just this, I always come back. So, yeah, I'm looking forward. That's right, it. And um, obviously, you know, you're not one to look ahead and look, you know, past the people you're fighting. But do you have any sort of names in mind for the people that you'd like to fight going forward after this? No. Whoever they put in front of me, I will fight. Whether they're number ten, number one, I don't know. But no, I don't. I don't want. I don't look into it like that. Whoever they put in front of me, I will fight. And each and every one of them, yeah, fight. I look forward to it. My best of luck.